Good afternoon, people. It's just gone midday uh, here in London town, and it is uh, Good Friday, Friday the 10th of April 2020, and it's uh, just gone past midday. Uh, let's have a look um, outside. Let's have a look outside, and uh, it is uh, around 20 degrees centigrade outside in London and um, we as you see there's nobody on the streets um, this is Good Friday so the weekend is Easter so Easter is being cancelled no socialization I've heard that some people have gone to the shop to buy Easter eggs and people in authority have turned around and they've said it's not essential so it's gone crazy so um, what this um, pandemic is actually showing is how um, crazy people are but here's what it's it's amplified it's magnified we already know we already knew people were crazy but this just kind of amplifies it so we get in a whole heap of uh, uh, people doing stupid things last night i was doing my recording and um, I was doing my lockdown party around midnight and uploading it. And again, <laughs> again, I got um, uh, locked down by um, by YouTube. And what YouTube uh, did was they, um, for me, if I upload anything and uh, it, it, it's it's they don't like it um, then it just doesn't go up I'm I think I'm lucky in that way because they haven't banned me or stopped um, <laughs> uh, banned me or stopped me actually broadcasting so but that footage is up, so I'm hoping to do uh, two uh, webcasts a day. One, this one is the more serious one, and the one later on at night is is uh, the party one, and that is um, uh, in 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 the hands of really YouTube. So if there's music on that that they don't like, they will shut it down. Um, the saving grace is that they haven't banned me or sanctioned me, so that's that that's a good thing now the software I'm actually learning is um, uh, this is the right so it's about two or three different software I'm learning at the same time one of them is um, one of them is OBS which is the uh, video and editing software and the other one is um, virtual DJ um, which is pretty hard actually and the third software is actually um, Microsoft um, PowerPoint you know and um, it is uh, not only uh, looking at the software or learning the software you have to um, the terms and condition and uh, you have to learn how to operate it and you need to practice and um, I've had um, I've had uh, <laughs> I've had uh, I'm using you to actually practice right let's go to the try and get to the next one okay why have I brought up Aisha Asia and friends I am gonna try to um, the hat I'm wearing if we go back to the hat I'm wearing um, the hat I'm wearing is actually uh, had been given to me by Asia and and I'm going to try and show you um, what um, she when she actually gave it to me we were, we were actually doing a live broadcast and um, she gave me the hat so let's see if I could get that to work which will be a very 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 
a clever trick. In and many guests. Uh, one of the guests is a bit late, so they just giving us a call and um, and telling us where where they're at. And I've just bought a little gift for Patrick here. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Let me let me try that, Patrick. Something different, isn't it? I was wearing a hat with a feather. And there you go. How about that dash in the Z look now? I'm, I'm, a, a, I'm a cowboy. I'm a real cowboy. Yeah. That looks quite nice. I have a feather in my hat. Yeah, so, yeah, so that's the same. One of our guests is just a bit lost, so. Mm. Um, his name is Jason, it's actually his birthday today. Um, he's going to be advertising some of his little business products. Actually, yeah, I feel like a law enforcement officer. Yeah, I think that's really good, actually. Yeah. That's yeah. really good. Nice. I'm the ranger around here. Yeah. Yeah. I'm the law around here. Get off your horse. Get and off your it. horse and drink your milk. Yeah. And tie it to the. You know, yeah. Are we going to find you? Um, I don't know. Yeah. Probably doesn't. So, anyway, we, you know, sometimes we ask Patrick questions. I know this is not really going to go out properly, and he sort of divulged into politics or whatever. And let's try and if we can backtrack a little bit. So, Patrick, um, what is your plans in the next three months? Have you got any events coming up, or you know, are you out there for hiring? Can people, you know, contact you to hire you for different like weddings, funerals, you name it? I think last time I wore a hat like this at an event. Um, uh, somebody came up to me and said, "Am I working tonight?" Oh, and how much? <laughs> <laughs> and your right. response was? Right. So that's why. Detail. I wear, that's why. Thank you very much for that. I love it. Yeah, sorry. Right. Yeah, thank you. But it's yeah. fine. Yeah. Right. My pleasure. So that, you see, that's probably why I wear this hat it's because it's a big film. Look at little bit. Yeah, because it has a more serious uh, implication yeah. to it. Um, what are you trying to say about me, out, mate? Well, yeah, I, I mean, say, yeah. yes. Take the feather out. No, no, no. Keep, keep the, the orange out. No, no, no. Keep it. Keep it. Yeah, no, yeah. no. Okay, you can leave it like yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we can talk about hats and the effect that hats I know. Have, right. Um, well, well, thank the, you. There. The question was about uh, what's what's what's, what's next. happening. What's yeah. next? Well, um, we thank you there. The thank you there, uh, Asia. That was a uh, fantastic. Um, uh, hat that was present. That's the actual uh, hat there I'm wearing at the moment. So, um, <laughs> oh, uh, I've got to say it to her. Thank you very much for that. Uh, also, trying to show a video within a video clip is a is a very hard thing uh, to do. But you know what? Um, now talking about um, talking about. Uh, the hat and looking at me in that picture there it looked like I was like um, I was like um, slightly overweight I was like a fat cat now I used to do regular broadcasting uh, a while back and what I found was that I ate I ate a lot I ate before the show and I ate during the show and then I ended up with uh, putting on not necessarily a lot of weight but when you're broadcasting you need a lot of energy going to your brain you know some people if drinking isn't a good thing because you get drunk and then you lose perspective and if you saw the test that I did I there, there were things I've forgotten. There were things that I miss, um, miss not necessarily misplaced, but um, I got the wrong way around. You know, it's like the the, the sugar level was actually low. Now the thing about uh, dieting and losing weight is that if you don't, if you don't take the energy in, if you don't eat the energy in or drink the energy in excessively, then uh, you wouldn't get excessive weight or excessive fat or you know so you don't have to uh, burn it there's like three traumas you'll go through well no the first one isn't a trauma the first one is a pleasure the pleasure of eating the food or drinking uh, the beer or the wine and that's a pleasure the other 
that's not necessarily a trauma. The other two traumas is that after that, you actually put on weight um, because you've taken in uh, too much energy that you are not going to use or haven't expelled in that short space of time before you eat again. And the third point or the second trauma, the third point is that when you have to go to the gym or you have to exercise in order to burn um, this excess excess calories that you've taken in. But you know what, I'm actually thinking that isn't too bad actually burning that those calories because your body is actually um, forced, the met metabolism is actually forced to actually work and it will produce or speed up the produce of certain chemicals and hormones in your blood, in your heart, the kidneys, the lungs and so therefore it might not be looking at it in relation to the current crisis we have it isn't really um, it's not really it, it so when you're out there exercising if your body's reproducing hormones and uh, vital chemicals then exercising does have its purpose so eating slightly over in order to burn it is a good thing and um, you know but eating too much isn't good and when you're sitting down uh, eating all the time especially in something like this because you need a lot of energy this reminds me of Martin J Martin J of um, Choice FM now Martin was a a very um, slim uh, sort of young man and well not slim and then when he had the Choice FM uh, radio show uh, he was eating now he's, he's calls himself Big Bappy literally and I think that's from actually um, uh, eating before the show now here is something you didn't know um, I was actually asked by Choice FM to actually do a soca show and to uh, produce uh, musically a young lady I think she came from Canada at the time but because of my relationship with the owners and they had a magazine uh, before called Roots Magazine, very glamorous magazine at the time and one of the things I do do is, is photography um, and you know it's hell to get money out of them so I'm thinking wait a minute I've had hell trying to get money out of you from the magazine now you've purchased Choice FM how is it, is it for me to uh, am I going to get paid and, and stuff and all you know the headache of screaming at so I said to myself now nah. you know so Martin had stepped in uh, he first started to do a soccer show then he did the breakfast show and then choice the rest is history um, but here I am missed opportunity <laughs> I've had so many missed opportunities you'll never believe it let me tell you about a page I've got. Uh, this is a Red 55 uh, 99 TV page. And on that page, it's really for people who, it's a really more um, in-depth page for broadcasters, actors, actresses, movies, um, and that kind of thing. So if you, um, you're in the business, and you want to link up with me on the Red 5599 TV page um, that's for you it, it, there isn't so many people on it because it's a very specialized page so it's kind of like for broadcasters and stuff mmm let's get on to a little bit more uh, serious subject uh, yes let, let me get back to me yeah mm, yes so that's the hat there uh, we're in London town uh, the time now is just just after midday um, I gotta take it easy the, the the background the background is is a constant background I don't know whether next time to do a lighter background um, we're using natural light from uh, from a window so and it's diffused as well uh, but we might change the background um, about uh, you know but uh, meanwhile 
back in in London um, things things yesterday this is Dominic Rob he's actually standing in for the Prime Minister at the moment when I was on air last night or when I was recording last night uh, the news came that um, Boris Johnson was off the uh, critical care but I thought he had actually left hospital no he's off the critical care but he's in an ordinary ward I think they usually say um, in for observations and then after uh, a short while they usually um, let you out I think it's like 24 hours I don't know what observation um, thing is now it's it's like 24 hours now if you're watching this and you've seen this and you want to make a comment just wherever you see the video just make a comment under the video or request um, we're finding a, a, a structure for this um, e eventually you know but because we're in lockdown and this is London and with the virus my my favorite guy at the moment is this guy this is this guy I would say is the commander-in-chief um, we almost in a World War three situation um, people are dying the UK uh, figures I mean I could have brought it up for you today uh, yesterday it was something like uh, not yesterday the day before is like 900 yesterday it was like 700 now that, these these are serious numbers of people um, for me that is actually frightening uh, in America it's like 1,500 a day now is dying uh, there are some states in in New York that um, there's some states in New York that uh, they don't they don't there's no lockdown it's like nothing is happening right and it is a it, it is a, for me it's a serious and dangerous situation Pe people see it differently and they, they they act differently and some people in in this uh, lockdown some people believe they have privileges right some people believe they have privileges over race some people believe they have privilege over the law some people believe they have privilege over the system you know the system always lets them through they can always get through and you can see this in certain situations being amplified uh, the news now from America is that the black population is being hit uh, harder and disproportionately over here in the UK the first two doctors that died of the coronavirus is were from actually uh, Africa right Commonwealth Africa now I hate that word Commonwealth because these are ex colonies to be a colony oh it w these were slave colonies where they took people um, and and enslaved them and had them work on plantation and some people even up to today still has this uh, slave mentality colony mentality Commonwealth mentality they still don't know who they are by the way if you speak English as your only language you're totally in utterly <laughs> lost but that's the that's the sub subject for a different different day um, right and with with the internet with the internet um, we have people who are looking at what I'm doing which um, you know I'm I'm I'm, I'm I, I am ha happy for you to um, you know um, think highly of me but I not into what you're trying to sell me and I could see it from a hundred miles off and listen by the way the reason why I'm still online is because all the authority um, know about me in fact I get special privileges from Facebook um, as you're gonna see in the, the next clip I'm going to show you the new Facebook um, style actually let me let me let me let me show you that now uh, let's go go back over here right this is a 
the new Facebook style it's in black it's it's not that good so I, I get privileged so they're watching me very very closely that's not only Facebook but some of the friends I had and stuff uh, we used to party hard um, so what I'm saying to if you're into some kind of stuff and what have you just leave me out of here I just don't want to know right and listen you communicate with me it can be easily traced back um, there's no form of communication today where it cannot be traced back if you are big and bad and important enough they they can trace you down so don't even bother communicate with me with your with what you're doing I, your negativity and and whatever you offer I, I just don't want to know now this is a friend of mine Benjamin Egbodo right now he uh, puts a lot of stuff up on my page he's in Nigeria and he does a lot of up-to-date um, videos of um, what's happening in Nigeria let's see if I could get all right that's I, I went to his page and this is his that's his that's how it looks in the new Facebook um, no actually it isn't it isn't his page it's my page on red 5599 um, let's go down all right that's his page in the the old Facebook style I uh, see yeah that's his page in the in the, the old Facebook style and my man actually reports and he puts his video up he's just put one up a a, a, a couple of hours ago and the <laughs> and and there's something he did um, he actually put it on the red 55 99 TV page and so he I don't he, he's I think he's figured out that I don't really like um, people putting stuff up on my my personal page but you could put it up on the the red 55 99 TV or you could put it up on the uh, promotion events and business that's for other people my personal page is about more or less kind of this a bit more serious and you know flip and flop from different uh, uh, genres whether it's 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 politics whether it's entertainment whether it's uh, a pinup nice sexy girl and stuff so um, that's my personal page now what I'm trying to do is hopefully I'll, I'll do a report a webcast um, every day um, well I'm gonna try and do it every day because this takes a lot of organizing and and work believe it or not I was up until 3 a.m. this morning and no actually it wasn't 3 a.m. 5 a.m. this morning and I had some sleep then I was up at 9 a.m. and then I've been technically working on stuff and just to get this um, little webcast out and even to get that clip of Asia and the hat right you, you know y'all y'all got me working I uh, see I didn't I forgot to take the the jacket off before I started the the, the, the webcast um, so y'all got me working so the un, at the end of this week I'm gonna have so much laundry you know usually when I'm in I you know you don't you ain't dressing for anybody or any, anything and I've seen a lot of professional um, people you normally come in the studio on television uh, they're now webcasting from home and they're in there like um, almost like in their pajamas and they're sitting in front of a, a webcam and it's like you know you you've forgotten just because you didn't have to go into the studio and stuff you you slouching around but when, when it comes to um, broadcasts and stuff one of the first rules is try and look your best you know but once you're home and you fall into a routine it's, it's kind of pretty hard I, I'm actually complaining to you guys my laundry bill right I've got loads of hats different kind of hats um, so every day I can have a hat and after a while I'll rotate it and change the color and stuff All right so I'm trying to do two webcasts one is uh, during the day um, and it's more serious it's about the virus it's about being locked down in London before I go to the last slide let's see if we can have a look outside and and see what's happening yeah let's go outside let's go outside 
in the rain. And I, it ain't raining, sunshine. Bring me the sunshine. Okay, this London town is about um, 12.30 there, 25. Um, hardly anybody on the street. It's Good Friday. Uh, it's April uh, the 10th, uh, 2020. This is Lockdown London. I'm just doing a, a webcast for you. Gotta say hello to my um, my friends over there in the States. One or two friends over there in the States who's, who's watching this. Um, I'm not promoting this fully yet because I've got to get it up to scratch and uh, once I've got it up to scratch once I've got it up once I've got it up to scratch and then I'll promote it because it takes a lot of practice so from Monday to now technically and practice wise uh, it, 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 it takes a lot and to get to show video and pictures and interactivity is it's a very it's a difficult thing you know so um, and plus not only am I looking at you or getting you to look at me um, I've got to operate um, almost like three or four mixing disc and um, I'm going to try doing a live stream soon and that's um, six programs running around in my head <laughs> because one of the important thing about the live streaming is that the the bandwidth of the the broadband you have um, whether it can handle it whether it, it, it will drop whether you'd lose the signal um, so the advantage of recording it is that once it, th there won't be any gaps only on on this side not the transmission the transmission part there's so much it's, it's filled with so many different floors. Back in the day, to do a live uh, transmission, it took a whole heap of different pe people, probably about a crew of 12, and a whole heap of different equipment. So today, with technology, um, the future is here. Here is the future. Um, but then we're in the middle of a, a kind of war. And the first part of this uh, virus is the the death and the sickness it's a short sickness a couple of weeks and you either live or you either die but that's the the first part the death the second part uh, is the economic effect you ever see the the video of the uh, a thermonuclear device going um, exploding it actually goes out and that's the first effect the heat and stuff and if you get caught in that you're singed you're disintegrated but there's a second part as it goes out the air is actually expanded expanded out um, and then the second part a uh, fraction or like a second later because the air is expanded out, it begins to suck back in. So there's a second effect, which is just as devastating. So if the first part going out didn't get you, the second part coming in might get you, right? And the second part of this coronavirus 19, um, COVID-19 uh, thermonuclear device is that it's the economic effect and all the business have been locked down. Now, if you can't make money to pay a high costing rent, if you're locked down for two or three weeks, you may never be able to get the money to pay the rent because, you know, if you have to earn a million pounds, if you have to turn over a million pounds in order to earn um, 50,000 pounds for your wage three months is three million pounds and you probably won't be able to make back up that three million pounds uh, when I say three million pounds that's the turnover you've got to buy stuff and sell it and pay um, uh, standing costs rent rates uh, staff cost um, light water electricity those are standing costs Right, so that could be three quarters of a million pounds. Right, so the other quarter of a million pound 
um, is, is stock that you sell that you have to replenish or uh, uh, let's add with the three quarter of a million pounds advertising all right you, you can stop the advertising during um, but if you actually pre-booked it then you have to pay so the second devastation from this virus is the economic and some people may never recover from it uh, America says they're gonna have they have around six million unemployed registered unemployed it could be more than 10 million because some people are on the books they're not on the books they off the radar and um, you know um, it it's the gig economy there's no socializing in fact all business shut down as long as governments here and around the world uh, if they deem it necessary then you can um, you can you, you 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 can continue with your business over here in the UK um, exemptions are um, hardware stores <laughs> hardware stores can open they uh, that is essential um, essential and the off license <laughs> right? so and that's classified as essential but here's what um, the law enforcers if they catch you going out they might say to you where are you going are you going for essential you go no I'm going to the uh, to the hardware store or I'm, I'm going to the off license I, I've heard somebody got fined for buying a couple of bottles of drinks because it's not classified as essential so we're in a kind of mess so if you're gonna go out there to do whatever right don't let enforcement <laughs> see you because you just might end up in a f getting a fine or uh, all that um, I don't know it's, it's gone crazy let me leave you with this last slide here you know I, I love this slide um, I think I swear there's two pandemics <laughs> right? all right uh, let me try and um, let me try and no that I'll, I'll do that some other time what, what what it is is the top there I swear there's two uh, pan we're fighting two pandemics one is coronavirus and the other one is stupidity right we are seeing um, the worst uh, we're seeing the worst in people and uh, we are seeing uh, the best in people we are seeing the craziness in people we are seeing uh, the madness in people um, we are we are um, seeing racial prejudice the people who believe they have privileges over other people right that now uh, is being amplified you know but let me say um, goodbye to you today uh, thank you for watching if you got any comments just put it under the under the video uh, when you see this and um, stay tuned hopefully later on we got the lockdown party ah what I forgot to tell you was the YouTube channel um, red 5599 videos is on the YouTube channel so you can see this hopefully you see this and the other videos and the the, the lockdown video you I not gonna stream I'm not gonna stream on um, on 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 Facebook uh, any music I can't handle that and you know good luck to those people who's in but I'll try and stream this which is more educational and, and, and serious and there's no music um, I'll try to stream that live right let me say goodbye for now and uh, stay safe um, the only advice I got for you is stay in don't mingle <laughs> use technology phone people Skype them um, FaceTime take care bye for now